Uh, good morning, I'm Sally Cook. I'm a Master Gardener from the University of Illinois Extension in Perry County. Today we're looking at a black maple tree. It can also be called the black sugar maple, hard maple, or rock maple. The black maple tree, Acer nigrum, is a medium to large sized tree up to 85 feet tall with a diameter of up to two and a half feet with a broad and rounded crown. The bark is dark brown to black, smooth when young, becoming furrowed and scaly with age. The leaves are opposite, simple, blades four to six inches long near, and nearly as broad, with three to five palmate lobes drooping on the sides. The edges are sparsely and coarsely toothed, green and smooth on top, and the autumn color is yellow to brownish yellow, but not red. The flowers are yellow, small, unisexual, with male and female flowers, mixed or in separate clusters on the same tree. The fruit, Samara, born in pairs, composed of a wing with a seed at the base, are brown to greenish and up to one inch long. These are what we called helicopters. The buds, flowers, and fruit are identical to those of the sugar maple. The black and sugar maple trees hybridize frequently, causing some taxonomists to classify black maple as a subspecies of the sugar maple. The differences appear in the leaves and their bark. The bark on the sugar is grayish with loose edged plates and the black is blackish gray and more deeply furrowed. And the sugar lethal maple leaves are flat. The black maple leaves droop. Here we have a sugar maple tree leaf and this is one of the black maple. And you can see the difference that the sugar maple is a flat, flatter leaf and the points of the black maple kind of droop. The sugar and black maple trees are still the source of all commercial maple syrup. The habitat for the black maple is moderately to well-drained and poorly drained bottom, bottomland forests. The wood of the black maple is strong, straight-grained, uniformly textured wood sold as hard maple. It is used for furniture, flooring, butcher blocks, baseball bats, and veneer. It is native to Illinois, and the range is New Hampshire across to Minnesota and South Dakota, south to Louisiana, and east to Georgia.